look at this lace already plucked already bleached hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel or if you're new thanks for clicking on my video so today we have another wig video and this <laughs> who's that girl okay this unit right here you already know from my face from the smile She's a keeper. This unit is from the brand Eunice Hair. They were kind enough to send it out to me to review for you guys today. And I cannot wait to tell you all the details about it. I'm gonna just let you know right now, it's giving summer, it's giving vacation, it's giving Barbie vibes. Like, yes, I ain't even mad at these 22 inches. Before we get into the video, if you're new, I hope you decide to join the family by hitting that subscribe button. I do a lot of hair videos, lots of makeup, a lot of hauls, tutorials, reviews, all the good stuff related to beauty with a little bit of fitness sprinkled in. I won't keep you waiting any longer. If you wanna get the details of this unit and learn how I installed her, completely glueless, might I add, there you go, then stay tuned and keep on watching. All right, guys, so we're going to do a quick little unboxing today. I am working with the brand Eunice Hair, and they were kind enough to send me this wig. It's another long one. She is 22 inches. So let's get into this box and see what goodies they sent. So right off the bat, you get this cute little pouch, and it has a pair of lashes single set of lashes but these are really really big outside of my comfort zone but i know a lot of people love them you also get a melting band for whenever you decide to glue your wig down or use your adhesive you also get this two pack is it a two pack or a single yes two pack of wig caps and these are the ones that are super thin perfect if you do the bald cap method and then you also get this little brush which i'm pretty sure is a powder brush yeah i've gotten these before i never use them but i guess they could be good for something another gift that came with this package is this robe and it says eunice on it is it eunice you nice i'm not sure feel like I've heard Eunice most of the time, but this is very, very soft and silky and flowy, gorgeous color. And last but not least, here is the unit. So we got a backup back here for you to see all the length of her, absolutely gorgeous. This is their six by four and a half inch pre-cut lace. And it says it's their wear and go water wave air wig now i don't know exactly what an air wig is so we will get into that but i love me a good water wave this hair is so soft absolutely gorgeous and then this hairline can we get into this hairline because i can tell y'all right now i'm not gonna have to do anything to this which is really exciting the baby hairs <laughs> i might be able to get some baby hairs right so the cool thing about this one, I think this is my first six by, is that six inches though? This is pre-cut, so I'm not supposed to have to cut anything off the front, but it says that this is supposed to be six inches deep instead of four inches. This comes in a lot of different lengths. This is 22 inches. It's supposed to be 180% density for this one, but I think on the website it only goes to 150. So it does have the adjustable band. This one, here's another one. So I just reviewed a wig that did not have the adjustable straps in the back. This one also does not, and it has the silicone. I actually really like that feature, so glad to see that again. You get a comb in the back and your two combs on the side and that is it. And then it is ventilated throughout. So this should be good for the summer. All 
All right, so I got my face done and I'm just ready to put this wig on. You saw how I ended the intro. The lace looks good. It is already cut. It has baby hairs. It is the center part. I don't know if I'm changing that or not, but we'll get into that. So details of this wig. She is a long one. She is 22 inches. I've been... I don't know if I'm going to say like I'm going to get to the point where I regularly wear 22 inch wigs, but I'm not as intimidated by them as I used to be. This is a six by four and a half inch transparent lace wig. So it is six inches across and then four and a half inches deep. I got mine, like I said, in 22 inches. And on the website right now, it's showing that the price for this one is $209. And it says that this comes in 150% density. They did send mine in 180%. I am not sure how much of a difference that is gonna make with the unit. I personally have always been fine with 150. I do love that this has this, they call it their air cap. So it's ventilated back here. So this is going to breathe. Fingers can go through it. Super, super light and easy to put on. And then y'all saw the hairline. Let me get my wig grip on and then we will see because I kind of feel like, I'm gonna try a center part. <laughs> I kind of feel like there was too much lace with the baby hairs, but I'm not a regular baby hair wearer. So maybe that's the norm. Y'all comment and let me know. If you wear baby hair regularly, is it supposed to be like a lot of lace in the front for the baby hairs to be able to lay down or how is that supposed to work? Because I personally have no idea. See, I feel like the fact that she was shifted to the side already tells me we need to do a side part. But we're going to try. <laughs> it looks different with the baby hair. That's just not something that I'm used to, but I kind of like how it looks. I'm trying to make sure. So, yeah, the knots are bleached on this. Y'all can see this looks good. And like I said, this is straight out the box. I didn't do anything to it. So I wanna get close enough so you can see the texture of it. It doesn't feel like it's snagging. Like this hair is beautiful. So this is gonna fit like a normal closure. I will say that I feel like she's running a little small because as you can see on the sides here, the wig is way up here. And I don't have room to pull her down. So this is fitting a little small for me. And you can see the same over here. Like a lot of my edges are out. So I'm going to put my mousse. Y'all, this is a vibe. Okay, back to the video. I'm going to go ahead and put my mousse. I'm going to put some powder. I'm going to try to keep these baby hairs. Y'all, I never do baby hair. And then I will come back and do my final styling as I talk through it. But it doesn't look like I'm going to need to do much with this wig at all.
but I just put a little bit of my Bumble and Bumble Curl Defining Cream in with some water from my spray bottle just to kind of help it define more and also take away a little bit of the frizz. You did see that I had a tiny little bit of shedding, but it was not much at all, which I will say I'm very impressed with a wig this long. I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of powder in my part, although honestly, I don't really feel like I need a lot because the knots are bleached. It's more just to help hide the lace. Ooh, which color are we gonna do? I don't want it to be too yellow. I have this little cream palette right here that I'm using instead because I want it to be more filling in. I always think that just helps the wig look more natural, but we don't need to leave this headband on because that mousse dries really, really fast. <laughs> Y'all, I am always amazed when I pull that off. I don't know how I'm feeling about these baby hairs. I think I'm just so used to having a clean hairline that this kind of feels like a lot for me. I don't know if they're just too long but I need them to be, maybe I should cut them. Or maybe I should just leave them because I don't know. I know baby hairs are very like specific to how certain people want to wear them, right? So it's not like there's a right way. That's a little better. Or a wrong way. Just a little something. But yeah, I can't do that super thick, super long. I feel like that's cute for the younger kids, but I'm a little too old for that. So we're going to do this. Yeah, that's better. So I'm going to go ahead and put some powder on my part. Just a little bit of my leftover bronzer. I think that is it for this wig. Y'all, this was so easy. I love easy, glueless, like... Look at this lace. Already plucked already bleached this wig cap is a little small for me and i have so much hair stuck to my face this wig cap is a little small for me but i mean i'm not showing the sides anyway so we're staying with the center part and i think this wig is absolutely beautiful thank you so much uni's hair for sending me this wig if you want to get it i do have a discount code down below it is not a commission code not anything like that so i'm not earning money it's just a discount for you guys if you want to try this wig if you're new to wigs i definitely think this is very very beginner friendly everything is done for you definitely worth the price and you can also flip it and do a side part which y'all know i'm probably do but I just wanted to show you what it looked like coming straight out of the box. If you love this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know what you think about the hair. I think this is perfect for the summer. Would you rock it? Like, look at this. I didn't even give y'all a full 360. Hold on. I got to stand up for this. She is long, long given all the inches so yeah couldn't forget that part comment below let me know if you like this wig would you wear it what do you think are you a middle part or a side part girl y'all know i'm a side part but we can do this middle part today thanks for sticking with me till the end of the video if you're new i hope you decided to join the family by hitting that subscribe button and i will see you in my next video bye I know that I